National 9 News. Melbourne today, farewell Ron Casey. His funeral bringing together some of the biggest names from sport and entertainment. Casey died earlier this week after years of poor health, but Tony Jones says he leaves a lasting legacy. They came to farewell a husband, a father, a friend, Premier and Cabinet, coaches and commissioners joining hundreds of others in remembering Ron Casey and reflecting on a life rich in achievements. He had an influence on so many people in so many ways. Testament to that was the diversity of today's congregation. We pray for strength and consolation in our loss and that we will be inspired by his courage, integrity and understanding. To most, Casey will forever be the ringmaster of that Sunday circus known as World of Sport. One of those rare, long-standing programs that became embedded into Melbourne's Sunday routine. Symbolically, Lou Richards carried a microphone to the altar. But while World of Sport might have been a labour of love for Casey, sport was his passion, in particular the North Melbourne Football Club. For the past nine years, he served the Kangaroos as chairman. Fittingly, last year's Premiership Cup was placed alongside the man who helped plot the win, one of two during the Casey era. He certainly was not your genial companion watching a football match, particularly where the kangaroos were involved. For all its beauty and pageantry, the two-hour service simply wasn't long enough to encapsulate the dreams fulfilled by Ron Casey in his 72 years, all the dreams he helped others fulfil. Wayne Carey had a fondness for Casey like few others, a moving image as captain carried chairman to a tune that sung together so many times before. North Melbourne is the team that plays to win for you and me. The past and present kangaroos formed a guard of honour outside the church. The procession then made its way to a part of Melbourne Ron Casey knew so well, the Channel 7 studios, where staff said their own special goodbye to their former boss. <laughs> So Ron Casey is gone, and so many people will miss his friendship. Tony Jones, National 9 News.